we got the Victron battery shunt installed and man this is a much cleaner installation than my first one with the Ames mainly just because of the uh, bracket that the shunt comes mounted in so it can actually be mounted somewhere that's where I chose to mount it seems like the cables are pretty clean and routing um, the monitor I'll show you the monitor it works inside the hole I already made for the Ames monitor and for it to work best I actually use the bezel from the Ames monitor because that's those holes are there the other ones a little bit smaller so the holes would be visible so I just figured what the heck I'll use that mount this to there that ring right there is what secures it so we're gonna charge the batteries right now they need to be fully charged before I hook this up and and program the uh, Victron battery monitor so we're gonna do that now while we go in and watch some motocross qualifications and Palo Fox Raceway get your tone baby later 